Hello guys, it's me Aidan Ismail Paul. Here we are again with Güler Ismailova. Great, and I'm so excited. Today's video again is about British English and American English. But in today's video, what we're gonna do? Uh, we are taking different verse. I mean, we are taking verse challenge today. Whoa, verse challenge again. I'm representing British English, American English with me. Yeah, she's there, but we're gonna get that English. So. My first word, how do you say underground in the United States? Um, it's subway. Subway? Yeah. Okay, interesting. All right, there you go. Okay. Come for me uh, if you can. <laughs> then we take apartment or we rent apartment. We rent an apartment. But in the United Kingdom, we rent a flat. Okay. Let's look at that, rent a flat. Um, Here I come. Mm, hold your horses. Okay, your turn. Very British. Hold your horses. Okay. Um, how do you say CV, curriculum vitae, in United States? Okay, we say that resume. Like candidates' resume was interesting. Oh, oh re resume. All right. I didn't know that. Interesting. <laughs> All right. There you okay, go. the game that you play kicking the ball around, it's soccer. Oh, okay, soccer. Uh, of course, the game was created in England, so it must be in British English. It's football. Um, football, yeah, it's football. Yeah, and let me explain you one thing. Uh, there is sometimes confusion about it because we have also American football and uh, do, try not to confuse them because American football and soccer are not the same words. Not the same activities. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, we go on a holiday. We go on vacation. Okay, interesting, interesting. Go for that, go for that. Come on, baby. <laughs> I've got perfect word for you. Uh, we pick up our medicine from drugstore. Okay, but we go to chemist for those medicine. <laughs> chemist. Okay, there I come. Okay, how do you say lorry in the United States? Uh, we say truck. A truck? Yeah. Truck. truck. Okay. Truck. truck. Quite <laughs> simple. <laughs> truck. Great. Okay. okay. Um, we wait on the line. We wait on a queue. Mm. Queue. Quite interesting, by the way, in spelling. Like Q U E U E. <laughs> yeah, but we just say queue. That's the beauty of British English. Queue. Yeah. <laughs> queue. Okay. Are you ready? Exactly. Always, by the way. How do you say mobile phone in the United States? Cell phone. What? Cell phone. Why cell phone? Mm, okay, why cell phone? Because it's a cell phone. <laughs> <laughs> what an explanation. Yeah. We say mobile phone because mobile means um, portable. So if something is mobile, it's portable. So mobile phone, it's a portable phone. And cell phone probably because it's small, like, like a cell. I don't know that. Interesting. So please look for that okay. and then, then let me I, know next exactly. video. Okay, come for it. Um, let me think. Cookie. You're not thinking, you're actually taking words. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, cookie. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. In British English, we say biscuit. Yeah. It's biscuit in British English. We love biscuits. No, <laughs> I, I don't love biscuits, but do, but do you love biscuits? Exactly, I love cookies. Um, Biscuits. But not cookies in accept all cookies. Uh, what? <laughs> what was that? Can Nothing. you repeat it? Accept all cookies. I, I'm just you accept trying, all cookies? I'm trying to say that it is not the same word, those cookies. Oh, okay, all right. Okay. Um, so, how do you say lawyer in American English? Um, yeah, it's attorney. Repeat? Attorney. Attorney. Okay, all right, interesting. Okay. Come yeah. again. Uh, where do you park your car? Oh, oh we, we, we park it in a car park. How about you? Parking lot. Yeah. Parking lot? Yeah. Mm. We pulled in a parking lot like that. Okay, interesting. How do you say engaged in American English? 
uh, like if you are doing something, if you are trying yeah, to if, if busy. you're doing some busy. Yeah. Okay, we say engaged. Okay, That's and nice another one. Um, closet. It's wardrobe in British English. Wardrobe. <laughs> Your turn. Great. So. As you can see, uh, there are some differences uh, between the words in British English and American English. Guys, don't get confused. If you use mixed accent, if you've got both British and American mingle, that's okay. So you can use British English sometimes, you can use American English sometimes. What we are trying to do here is not to differentiate the accents, just to show you the beauty of the language. Enjoy the language. Doesn't matter whether it is British English or American English or Australian English, Scottish English. Indian does not... Why? Indian English. <laughs> It does not matter what language you use, what accent you use, just enjoy the language. I hope the video was useful for you. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe the channel. Thank you very much and see you on our next video. Bye-bye.